Okay, we are going to be showing you how to add and remove shortcuts and widgets to the home screen. And what we're going to do here is we are going to find a spot on the screen, a blank spot somewhere, and we're going to do a long press. So we're going to long press right now. That's going to give us a screen that asks us, do we want to add a shortcut or do we want to add some type of a widget? Well, we're going to do a shortcut first. Click on that. It's going to ask us what type of a shortcut do we want to add. And there's several different options in here. But let's just say we want to put an application on the home screen. So what this is going to do is this is going to give us the option to add a shortcut from one of the programs we have inside the phone itself. So let's say that we want to add barcode scanner on the home screen. We're going to click on barcode scanner. This next menu that pops up is going to say do you want to rename this? Now the reason why it's asking me that is because I have Launcher Pro installed on my Fascinate. This will allow you to rename the icons or have no name on them at all. Me personally, I like just leaving the, the stock name on it. It's Barcode Scanner. I'm going to click OK. And you'll see Barcode Scanner icon is on the home screen. Now if I want to add another one, I'm going to find another spot. And I'm going to long press again. We're going to go back into shortcuts one more time. We're going to click on applications. It's going to let me select another application. Let's say we want to put the browser on there. Click on the browser. It's going to ask me if I want to rename it something else. I could put web. Click OK to leave it as browser. And there it shows up. Now let's say I don't like where they're positioned on the home screen. The next thing we can do is we can move these around. How we're going to do that is the same long press, but you got a long press on top of the actual icon. So I'm going to long press on the browser, and it's going to vibrate the screen, and it's going to allow me to drag that icon over somewhere else on the screen. We'll do it again with the barcode scanner. Long press, it vibrates, and move it over somewhere else. So now we've added an icon, which is a shortcut to the home screen. What that's going to do is it's going to allow you to, instead of going through the menu screen, and surfing through and trying to find the exact program that you want. If you actually have it right on the home screen, click on it, and there it goes. So we're just going to hit the home screen, go back. Now I'm going to show you how to remove these from the home screen. It's going to be the same operation again, the long press, and you'll see this trash can. You're going to drag it down to the trash can. The icon's going to turn red, let go, and there it goes. We'll do it one more time with the barcode scanner long press on the icon, move it over the trash can, it turns red, and there it goes. So now we're going to move on to the next thing which is how do we add a widget. Now what is a widget? A widget is like this clock that I have on the home screen here. This is a clock and a weather widget and what these are is live icons but they're actually a bigger um, menu um, built inside the phone itself and it's going to allow you to do other things rather than just being a shortcut to the program like this thing runs in the background. So we're going to add another widget to the home screen. I'm going to long press and now we're going to pick a widget this time instead of a shortcut. So we're going to pick a widget. It's going to give us all the options for widgets. I've got beautiful widgets installed in here. I've got a couple other things. And let's just say that I want to put a Pandora widget. I'm going to click on Pandora and there it is. And all that's going to do is give me access to my Pandora account. We'll show you how that works. We just click on it. Pandora is going to go into my online account. It's going to find my internet radio. And then on the home screen, when things are playing in the background, it's going to have the pause and rewind. Let's do it one more time. We're going to hit long press, go into another widget. Let's say we want to pick another widget inside here. What else do we have? Let's do a Google search. And there we have it. Google search widget right on the home screen. That's going to allow us to do some searching. So let's say I don't want the Pandora on there anymore. We're going to long press Pandora. Drag it down to the trash can. Let's say I want to move Google. Long press it. Move it around. So there you have it. We've added and removed icons, widgets, and we've showed you how to move them around on your home screen. Thanks again for watching.